Okay, we are here with uh, Conan uh, at Semi Fabric, and we are making 20 questions with Conan. So, um, what means music for you? What? Music, the, the word music, what is saying to you? Oh, um, what, like, what does our music mean to us? Music, like generica. Music in general, uh, well, I, th I find it's a form of escape, and um, I think it's, it's cool to be creative as well. I've kind of always wanted to like sort of make music since I was a kid, really. So it kind of um, being able to tour and 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 be on the road doing that and uh, make a make a job out of it feels kind of good, better than an office job. Same question. Well, yeah. it's, it's, it mean to you? it's just a constant thump, 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 and you can never hear the lyrics. Yeah. Um, but that's teenagers today, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know, it's just like catharsis or something, something like that, emotional kind of expression, yeah. that kind of thing. Some bands are more emotional than others, aren't they? Yeah, I suppose. Okay, next one. So, uh, best experience as uh, playing live? The best experience? Yeah. Um, me personally, it's um, always like a, like a smaller club rather than a festival. Usually, the indoor shows are more fun than the than the outdoor shows. We've been lucky enough to play Hellfest twice and uh, Bloodstock in the UK once, and um, they're always like really awesome festivals. But I'd say probably my favourite shows have always been indoor ones. A Maryland, um, Maryland Death Fest in America. We played that um, twice now, and that's like that's an uh, amazing festival. I'd say probably the first time we played that was probably one of my favourite shows live. You can imagine. Yeah, it was it was fun. Do we pass the thing around for every question? I don't think so. I if you guys want to jump in, just yeah. say. Yeah, yes, I just ask with Conan playing with Hell, Hellfest was amazing because like, that was the biggest crowd I've ever played this, so that was really cool. But um, in the past, like I did tours of South America, that was awesome. That was brilliant. Um, just the, be the best, like in like John said, indoor shows hmm. are usually the best. But also playing in Japan last year with Conan, that was like particularly cool. <laughs> so yeah, can't really beat that. Yeah. 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 Well, I've only played a few shows with Conan. Um, and the best ones are the really small ones. Yeah, not we're close to crew. Really sweaty, but um, yeah, I just worry that I'm going to fall over sooner or later. That's that's my main fear with playing live. Is it's at some point I am just going to keep over. Yeah, yeah, Dave, Dave is playing Fudge Tunnel, I must say, and Dave has played some huge stages. He played the Sepultura before. Okay. Toured the Sepultura early nineties. But now I'm, I'm ninety three years old. Yeah. And so we had to scale really it down a bit. To be doing this, frankly, mm. and he works me like a dog. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Life in your old dog, yeah, It's just, it's just a. Come on, that's good. Nice. <laughs> and the the most embarrassing thing that ever happened in a tour. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, I guess you have a lot. <laughs> Where should we go? With okay, John. Um. Oh, we can't. I, I, I couldn't possibly say. Oh. I, we had fondue when we were in um, Switzerland. Not Switzerland. Not Switzerland. It was no, it was Switzerland. Yeah. Switzerland. What was the town? Uh, Dudingen. We had, we had, yeah. and um, it, it. Uh, yes, we, we had fondue, and that kind of upset my um, system, shall we say? I won't go into more detail than that. Mm. Yeah. It was messy. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I guess I, you have so much stuff to say, but yeah, yeah. we couldn't possibly say. We, <laughs> we have photos, right? I can send you. Photos. Yeah, okay, we have photos. <laughs> We've been. The, yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. You don't want to see them, but yeah, normally <laughs> involving um, bodily fluids. Okay, cool. Mm. <laughs> it really was quite fluid as well, wasn't it? Okay. Yeah. And yeah. if you could describe uh, Conan the band in five words, what could it be? Uh, Maybe three or whatever, oh, not wow. more than five. Conan, Conan the band, well today, Conan the band in three words, Johnny, Dave, John. That's good. This is the lineup for this tour. Okay. And maybe if you zoomed out a little bit, you could call this sort of like heavier than some. Okay. I don't know, I was thinking. No, I can't do any better than that. 
Yeah. yeah. Have you even some? What about politics? What do you think about this? Politics? Yeah. Oh God, I don't really get involved in politics. I, I enjoy it. spectating, okay. but I don't really have a particular strong viewpoint on it. Good. Okay, so uh, what is better, touring or being at home? Uh, having clean clothes, being at home. Yeah. Mm. Touring's great for a while, and then after a Go few on. weeks, getting at home seems a lot more appealing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. After like two or three days, it's now, like rubbish. What, 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 what week is this? Week four? This is all, yeah. yeah. Now being at home looks pretty good. Mm. Yeah. But, but the beginning is the best, and then... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah but then once yeah. you get home, yeah. It feels weird not getting back in a van. Yeah, that's yeah. Cool. Wake yeah. up in your own bed and panic because you're not, you've got no van to get into. You, you don't have a tour to manager. in the cupboard instead. Yeah. That's it. Getting up at 6 a.m. to go to work on a cold winter morning. Like, yeah. mm -hmm. Then you want to be back in the van again. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> it's also like a routine, but it isn't. Mm. And then when, when you're at home, it's like just, it's, such, it's so different. And it's understandable why so many people turn to drink and drugs. I mean, at our level, mm. we're playing like regular shows in cool clubs where you can imagine some of the bigger bands who would play stadiums or, you know, play to like thousands of people each night. And um, mm. the rush that they must miss when they get home must be overpowering. Mm. Yeah. It's not a surprise that so many people sort of struggle with that side of it. Yeah. But yeah, it's not, I don't think it's quite the same for, for us. Yeah, I think so. So, what's the worst thing you've ever done and been drunk? Uh, okay, I don't get drunk very often when I play, but we, when we were in Portland a couple of years ago, I got quite drunk. The whole show was was filmed, oh. and it's like it's totally unlike me to be like like that guy on stage. But um, I was drunk, and I was like, someone bought me a drink, and I was like, oh, it's a double, by the way, and stuff like that down on the microphone, oh. like like a prick. And then at one point, I, I was playing, and I sort of fell backwards into a curtain. But inside the curtain was a, a, like, um, like a hard, like a, a wall, but it was hidden by the curtain. So I fell into that and it kept me upright. And then I, I carried on going, well, that's probably as crazy as it gets really for me. I once had an argument with my wife whilst very drunk and visiting someone else's okay. um, home. And I stomped off in a huff and slept in a snowdrift. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> So kind of, it's kind of heavy. That wasn't a clever thing to do. <laughs> I had a similar one where a long time ago I woke up on the third story of scaffolding on a building site. <laughs> <What's> <laughs> sake? I had about 3, 3 a.m. Oh my god. So that's, that's not even the worst, that's the, just what I can tell you. That's what you can tell you. That's just a random one. Yeah. That was yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what's the best and the best the, and the worst for being a musician? Uh, say that again, That's sorry. The best and the worst part of being a musician, like a rock star, or I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Well, I wouldn't call us rock stars. Yeah, but it's not way too Well, for me, the best part is being creative. I really love that. Um, I'm not sure if I'd cope very well if I didn't have that, um, being able to express myself in that way. So. I guess the worst part of it is it's kind of like it's a, it's a, it's a challenging lifestyle. Mm. You know, that's, I mean, it's a double-edged sword, that particular aspect of it. Because on the one hand, it's um, inter interesting and um, fun and it's a challenge and, you, you know, you don't get bored. But on the, other, on the other hand, it can be a little bit random. But, um, yeah, so doing okay so far. Yeah, no, the best thing is the travelling and the worst thing is the travelling. Okay. You know, it's because, you know, it's, it's you no know, routine, yeah. you know, so... But at the same time, getting to see all these places is amazing so mm. but a lot of the time you see these places and you see them from a van then yeah. you, see yeah. a venue, you, see then you get, the, in, the get to a hotel or yeah. you stay in a band flat and then you get back in the van and you leave again so you just see them a yeah. bit sometimes you get to see them better mm. but yeah we've had, we've had a few little trips around cities mm. that's true yeah. so best band and worst band best band and worst band Ooh, tricky. My Ever? I, could, I couldn't possibly yeah. say. Um, yeah, it's in for me. I could worst say. band, uh, the Goombe Dance Band. Okay. Yeah. yeah. They were all Best band, Fudge Tunnel. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I have to agree <laughs> with that. We have yeah. to say that. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Um, so, favorite food and favorite drink? Oh, well, for me, it'd be Vietnamese first soup. You know, the Vietnamese broth. 
Okay. I don't know. You, pro- you spell it P H O, but you pronounce it pho. Okay. That's my mm-hmm. favourite food. Um, whiskey and cheesecake. Yeah. Together. Mm-hmm. Guinness and I probably pho as well. I, I love pho. Yeah. It's okay. really, really good. Yeah. Cool. Uh, what's better, being in a relationship or single? Oh. Uh, Sorry, what was the question? <laughs> what's better, being in a relationship or single? Oh. Relationship. I've been married okay. since I was almost a teenager. And look at cool. I'm gorgeous. No, no, happy. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say being in a relationship is better okay. for me personally. I'm on the fence. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. <laughs> Tough time. <laughs> I'm only 20, so it's okay. Yeah. Good. <laughs> and what's your biggest dream? Did you reach it with Conan or something more? I don't know. Being able to travel so much is probably something, something and, um, that I would have dreamt of as a kid. Where we are achieving that, so I'm pretty happy, really. Okay. Yeah. Mm, I, I have no dreams. Okay. No. I've fulfilled yeah. all my ambitions. Yeah. You know, just take each day as it comes. That's good. Mm-hmm. Well, the favorite place in the world, like for playing or for visiting? Uh, I don't know, on, on this tour. Probably one. Say like Germany. Oh, yeah, Germany. Yeah. <laughs> Dresden, yeah, Dresden, yeah. Dresden, Dresden, yeah. The best. You really That's, need a PA. Yeah, yeah. The drive from Krakow to Dresden is probably one of my favourite drives. And uh, today we did like a nine hour like um, version of it because we enjoyed it so much. So Dresden is actually my favourite city. Yeah. It's only five minutes normally, isn't it? Yeah. We kept going round and round in circles because it was so much fun. So. Yeah, it has to be Dresden. Okay, so that is the last one, and then the, uh, what would you prefer to be, a fish or a f- uh, bird? A fish or a bird? Bird, definitely. Well, you can yeah, fly or you oh, can be down the water? Oh, fly. Depends though, what kind of fish and what kind of bird? Oh, a, dolphin, like, I don't a know. goldfish on the water. Yeah, yeah, if it was a really shit bird. Yeah, if you were like, like a, a shark or a something. Pigeon. A, shark? Like a pigeon or a, or a great white shark. Yeah, I think I'd, I'd rather be a bird. Albatross, I think. I'd go yeah. for an albatross. Fly is better. Yeah, I'd rather be able to. F- I'd, yeah, I'd rather be able to fly because I can already swim. Hmm. So then, uh, being able to fly. Yeah, you can see more. Yeah. I think. You can't yeah. breathe underwater though. I, yeah. I actually can. Oh, oh you yeah. Yeah. Sorry. learned something new again. <laughs> <laughs> Every yeah. day, something else, yeah. 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 I wonder what they were. I thought it was a tattoo. <laughs> yeah, scabs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for finishing the interview, so I am. Um, uh, why do you think people should listen to your band? Um, why should they? Well, if they bought a ticket, they should listen to us because they're here. Um, <laughs> they should listen to. I, I guess we're, we're we're one band in quite a, a, a cool scene. Okay. There's lot. There's lots of cool bands, and um, hopefully, some people would view us in that light. I don't know. Yeah, I think so. I saw you many times, and I always like it. So. Cool. Yeah, we're like we're the best band ever or something. No, we're not. <laughs> we're not. There's lots of room for improvement. I guess that's one reason to come and see how strike we are. Yeah. <laughs> see if we've gotten better from the last time. Yeah. Yeah. Which you probably haven't. I mean, you can probably answer that better once you've actually witnessed it later yeah, on. Yeah, of course. Right. Yeah, but it's like for people seeing the interview and they never mm. see you, so mm. for attracting them for, for yeah. the future. It's quite loud, if that's yeah. any Yeah, help. yeah, I know. <laughs> It's a, that's a difficult question to answer, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Because we're amazing, obviously. Yeah. Mm. Come on, that's good. You are saying you're yeah, good. Yeah. That's just the point. It's, not, it's yeah. like confidence. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Apart from that, I couldn't really comment on that one. I mean, the more people that listen, the better it is for us, so. Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay. As long as they listen and like it, of course. Yeah. If they listen and hate it, then it's not so good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> just remain a, a, a myth that no one's ever heard that everyone thinks is good. Probably sell a lot of records. That's the way to do that it. That no one ever listens to. Yeah, so that's the, that's the art of PR. Mm. It's the modern world. Actually not. Mm. <laughs> okay, so do you want to add anything or just um, I can't wait to see you again live? No, we're excited to play, but I couldn't. I, I don't know. And even the venue is looking so much bigger now. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's changed, hasn't it, since since the last time? Well, you've not been here, Dave, but... I've no, yet, I haven't, no, no, no. Don't think so. Johnny and I have played here before in, in, in different bands, and I, I drove a band who played here just a couple of years ago. Mm. And um, it was it, it was the old shape then. Yeah. But they were just telling us then that 
um, Tony was telling us that they're about to renovate it. Yeah. And uh, I'd totally forgotten about that until we got here today. Mm. And we saw it. It, it looks, looks cool. So cool. Yeah, it looks awesome. And the sound is really so much better. Yeah, yeah. The lights too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's good for photos. <laughs> yeah, yeah, oh yeah, good. Good for you guys. I'm excited for, to play. Yeah, good. So thank you so much. And thank you. Waiting for it. Good luck. Thank yeah, you. Thanks very much. Cheers. Cheers.